So I moved this dress from this to this. And I used BDS fringe for it. I'm going to show you how I made this BDS fringe in this tutorial. Welcome to my channel. Because it's gold, we need a gold strip for this tutorial. Any strip or color of your choice, but I'm using this one. We also need beads. But here, we're using three types of beads. We're using the sand bead. We're using the straw bead, the longer one, and the one that has a spiral design like you're seeing right here. And then finally, we need crystal beads. This is it right here. We also need needle and thread. Let me not forget that. So let's jump straight into the tutorial. Pick your beading needle and there's no need for me to show you how I threaded the needle. You already know how to do that. I'll just pick the needle and thread and tie a knot. So yeah, tying it twice is okay. I'll pick the sand bead right now and I'll just pick one sand bead into the needle. Next thing I'll pick is one long straw bead. I'll put that into the needle. After that, I'll pick one crystal bead. After picking the crystal bead, I pick another straw bead, pick another crystal bead, and I'll seal it up with a sand bead. After that, you just tie. But let me show you a very fast way so that it will be easier and clearer. So first thing I'm going to be doing is to pick one sand bead, one spiral, one crystal, one spiral, one crystal, one sand. That's it. So I'll put that right there and i'll shift the sand bead downward and put the needle through all other beads this is it right here after i've done that i'll just bring out the needle and tie make sure you tie it in such a way that it doesn't look messy and tacky so that the beautiful work you have done would not be a waste after tying it i'll just get a scissors and cut it and that is the end so i told you that i was going to make about six yards of this i'll show you what the six yards looks like this is just two pieces right here wait till you see when i did the whole six yards of strips it was stunning see eh, camera is not doing justice to this thing you are seeing right here it is beautiful let me give you an idea of how you can use this i'm making this dress for myself since last year i've not finished it i don't know why it's because it's my dress because the client's dress i not finished it anyways i pinned it on the dress because i will still remove it <laughs> so this is how there are many ways you can do it but this was how i chose to do it you can put this fringe on a sleeve on many other things i know that you are very creative for me after this video i'm going to remove all of them because i did, i couldn't even cut it let me show you the back the back is very funny <laughs> tell me what in the name of jeremiah is going on here <laughs> anyway thanks so much for watching my video i'll see you in my next one bye